Good afternoon, Fab Five. This is Annalisa speaking. Today, I actually give a shit. So, I put on a little bit of makeup. But just a little bit. I put on some lip stuff and eye stuff and brown stuff. Anyway, I just got back from Convo and it was awesome. So awesome. They had this gospel choir come in and they were called the FSC Gospel Choir. I was all, do we have a gospel choir? Because they were called the FSC Gospel Choir. I was like, we have a gospel choir? I'm a music major, I should know these things. And I was hearing everybody else say, we have a gospel choir? No way. Wow. And then we have this, and we have this dude, he's like a gospel person to go to when you want to sing gospel songs or sight read piano and composition when you have composition homework. Anyway. So, it was awesome. I took some video. Don't mind the effects, because, uh, because, uh, well, it was dark, and I don't have night vision on my iPod. So, yay! Speakers are horrible for some awesomely epic reason. The pe the uh, other students wanted to want to just get up and do the whole thing, and go side to side and clap and stuff. It was really cool. Oh, this isn't working out. Ugh. Pants on the ground. Pants on the ground. Looking like a fool with your pants on the ground. That's really, really cool. You know, I've been reading Graceling. I took the cover off to protect it. And I just passed the part where the two main characters do the nasty. I was like, okay, they confess and then they have sex. What? I mean, of course they have the hots for each other and stuff. They've been avoiding it ever since they met. So I'm just wondering, uh, did I expect this to be a teen book? Did I expect this to be a preteen book where there's no sex? Yes! I did. What I didn't expect was five minutes after they confessed their feelings for each other, they do the nasty. So I put the book down for a couple days. What really weirded me out is that the author felt that she needed to get their love story out of the way before they started to do the whole big rescue mission. But yeah, I'm almost done. What I do know is that I am now enjoying the story very much because it was so slow and just, they were in the forest forever and just, just uh, oh yeah, I set up your, um, the Christmas present you gave me. See, it says do your homework right there. And I decided it says practice. That was the greatest thing. This dude in my class, uh, we were presenting our compositions in music theory, and he named his piece for Macaulay. And Miss Macaulay is our theory teacher. Kudos to you if you get the joke. Are you ready for the most annoying song ever? gets me up every morning. Ooh, also, yesterday was really fun uh, because I have this class called Games and Rhythmic Activities and uh, <clears throat> we played cricket. It was so much fun. We played it with like kid size cricket bat thingies and a tennis ball. It was epic. Hey, who ate my brownie? <laughs> 